Hi, hello everyone, and welcome back to Niche. We are back on the icy islands, and last time we had quite a few children. So uh, these are all—all all of them are Nero's kids. And oh my god, I didn't even realise they like the boys all have purple eyes, and the little girl has blue eyes, and I think that's really cute. I just love that. The, just the way that it's like, just the, all the boys have purple eyes, and the girls. I don't know. And then we've got over here, Cookie has had her first child with, I can't remember actually who the dad is of this one. I think it's Koi. It is! And I think he looks just like Chestnut for some reason. Or it's just not, oh I guess they look very similar, don't you think? Don't you think? Maybe it's just because of the spots, but I think they look really similar, which is quite funny to me. Um, and then we have the first baby from Lana and he is Loki's child and I think does he have big body he does perfect he's got big body which is amazing we love that we really want big body to come through so I'm very glad that's happened um so I've named all of the uh, all of Nero's kids not these guys kids so we've got Chester and Sonny who are the twins uh which I can't remember who the mum is um when I'm trying to look is it it's Tamale. Okay, so Tamale is their, their mother. And then we have Honey's child, who is Inferno. And then we have Vero, who is obviously Nero's child. And I wanted to make her name similar to Nero. That was the closest I could make it, just because they have like the exact same pattern, and I think that's adorable. So, um, yes, that's all of them. That's all of those babies there. So I'm going to get these babies to jump out of the nest quickly, so that uh, their mothers can jump in and have more babies. Wait. Syrup. Oh, you're the mother of ne you're the mother of, mother of Vera. Okay, yeah, yeah, of course, of course, of course, course. I didn't t say anything about their, uh, oh, you know. <laughs> okay, I want to move Topaz in here to take take over that uh, berry bush duty. Uh, Avery can continue to pick berries from that tree. Uh, Lark was supposed to be looking for bunnies to catch, but there's not any around so far. So I'm gonna leave him there until anything jumps around at him and then I'll just get to do something else. Oh, there's a bunny right there which Starlight like, can grab. There you go, and then I need to get it back in the tree which is going to take a while. Um, okay, so Shade, I think I might get him to go over to Lana so that they can start having children as well. Oh, was that something that we caught or... I hope it was something we caught because it's there. I think it might be the one that... I think Lana tried to um, grab one last time and I think she poisoned it so I think that might be one that we poisoned. So yes. Oh, perfect. Running right into Tortilla's arms there. Um, then we've got Louise over here who's got qu quite a few days left and then her mate Sparrow and they, they have a decent amount of time, uh, time left. So I'm gonna wait another day for these winged creatures to have another baby. Uh, yeah, to have another baby. I'm gonna get, I guess Loki can just do whatever really. <laughs> uh, there's no bunnies around so we can't exactly catch any bunnies but it's really warm so oh! There you go, they're all up here now. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's really warm though, so we don't have to worry about um, freezing in the middle of nowhere. So that's them. And then I, I think Tamale's had a baby with Chester. Oh, she's pregnant with his kid at least. So, or was it Cub? I can't remember which one it was. I think it might have been Cu uh, Colt, sorry, not Cub. <laughs> that was his dad. Oh, that was ages ago. Oh. Yeah, I think it might be Colt's child that they're pregnant with. I think, I think it is. It should have been, hopefully. I can't remember. Um, last time was a while ago. So let's get Honey in the Nest as well. There you go. And then you can just grab from that. Oh, perfect. And then Syrup is also pregnant with Nero's second child of beds together. I'm going to leave her for a day. Um, is anybody else? Are there any other females that need to get pregnant? I don't actually think there are. Um, Cookie's all, all the way over there though, so I feel like maybe I could move her, but she's also far from... She doesn't want to leave her baby behind, basically. So, Nero cannot breed with... Uh, and Nero's done with breeding now, so I'm just going to get him to look after his kids, really. He can stay next to them, keep an eye out for them, make sure that they're all safe. There you go, let's just grab some stuff while we can. And then uh, Andrews might be the last one to have babies because he's quite young. And then Lark, I'm sorry, I, oh, perfect. I was going to say I swear I haven't seen any bunnies for you to catch, but there you go. And that's everyone again. So let's go to the next day. And again, I think it 
I don't think it counts as being um, cold weather when it's not like freezing cold. So yeah, we've still only spent 10 days in here, even though we've technically spent 26 days here. So we've got Baby, who I'm assuming are Colt's children, because like this one looks just, just like him. Uh, also, oh, I really love that. He looks a lot like his grandfather in the sense that he's got the um, like beige, like uh, darker stripes, whereas Colt had the same um, fur colour as his dad, but lighter stripes. Whereas now, this one has the same stripes as his granddad and a different colour to his dad, which is quite cute. I think I think that's adorable. I don't know. I just, I just like the way the genetics have worked recently. <laughs> I think it's a nice a nice little thing. Uh, and then these guys are going to get to come together and they can have a baby together because I did say that they're not going to have just one baby each together I think um, with the non- with the winged creatures I'm going to get them to have um, maybe like two babies each together oh there's a bunny right there ah dang it okay uh, there's a bunny right next to Louise which- oh there's two! oh there you go wish you can grab that one as well there you go <laughs> and then Sparrow's right here so if he can- there you go see there's so many bunnies around oh my goodness Oh my goodness, what do I do? Do I get Lark to grab them? Do I get- I'll get Finley to grab this one. Because he's close. There you go. And there's one for Lark to grab up there. There you go. There's one down there which he can grab as well. Oh, there's one there too! Oh my goodness, this is insane. Can you get to it, Avery? She could fly over there, but I think I'll- I'll leave her in the tree. Dang it, I didn't mean to shake the tree. Oh well. It's fine. <laughs> it's fine. There you go. And you can grab some more um, nesting material while you're there as well. Topaz. And we've got Starlight who is out of the tree, but she can jump straight back in the tree and start picking from that one as well. And there's a bunny right there next to Loki, so I'm gonna grab that one. There you go. Oh, I love all this. I love all the bunny hunting we've been able to do. Look at them. They're everywhere. Oh, this is like the best part of the icy islands is the, all the all the bunnies. Okay, and then I'm gonna get Cookie to breed with somebody else, and she can breed with. Uh, Colt as well so I'll get her to make her way over to Colt and I guess Colt over to her too because otherwise he's gonna pass away. Here we go um, and I'll just get them to breed together. I don't really think he needs anything in his genes. I've been like not giving him anything in his genes for ages so <laughs> I'll put her back in this nest over here. Uh, Syrup you can actually get into the nest that you were in before with your daughter like that. Um, and then we've got these guys over here who have a decent amount of time left to live. To be oh, Honey does not. So she's currently had a baby with um, Colt and Nero. So she can now have a baby with Chestnut, I think. Oh no, she's not going to be able to have a baby with um, somebody. I do really like, I really like um, Koi for some reason. So I think I might get a tough baby with Koi for sure. Um, I like Chestnut and I like Andreas. They are very similar though, so... Oh, I don't know. I don't know what to do. One of them has to not have a baby with them. Is she like... Hmm. I don't know. Um... Oh god. Um... I guess I'll get them two to meet and they can breed and then she can come back over to the group sort of bit over here and make a nest there and who's got a leech I just saw it swimming along over oh who has a leech is it this baby over here it is oh no and he's all alone too Andreas is there any chance you could oh my god amazing he like saved his life <laughs> um uh Vera can just I don't know explore why not Koi is... Koi can make his way over here and he can also get um, Tamale pregnant while we're here. There you go. And then Inferno can just I don't know, explore as well. Same with all of his brothers. <laughs> They're all just doing whatever really. I think I can heal the bunnies like jumping in and out of the hot springs and stuff which is quite funny to me. Let's get you to grab some of the stuff that's around. Same with Chestnut, you can just do that. Okay, and that's everyone again. So we'll go to the next day. Oh, uh oh. Okay, there's a bird. So, um, okay. I've got to be really careful now. Where can I attack you from? Is there a way? You're just not above me yet, I guess. 
There you go. Well, I've, I've killed some bunnies. But I'm going to come over here with Lark and see if he can attack that bird in any way. I guess it's closer this way then. But it's going to keep moving, so it's going to be really hard to like, keep an eye on it. I want to get you to grab that one, Topaz. Thank you very much. It might swoop down and grab that one, actually. But we're right next to it, so hopefully not. And then I want to make sure that all the babies are protected and cared for. So that the birdie doesn't come to get them. Uh, we've had a few more babies um, this time. So who have we had? We've had Syrup's little son, who looks just like Syrup. Look at that. Looks just like her. That's adorable. Even down to the, the claw, the one claw, the blue eyes. Oh, I was about to say he doesn't have stinky tail. He does have stinky tail, which is good. Um, but we've got this one who is... Uh, oh my gosh, what, who's baby would you be? You'd be a cult kid, wouldn't you? Yes. And she's got like little socks. Oh, I didn't realise that was a bird on her back. But I thought that like those two little paw stripes were her only uh, sock thingies were her only her only pattern. But that's really cute. Um, who else have we had? Oh, we've had this little one. Who are you? Wow, you are. I like your white antlers compared to your like bright orange fur. I'm assuming you're 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 Koi's kid, aren't you? Are you Koi's kid? That's gotta be Koi's kid. Yes, that's Koi's kid. A very cute kid as well. I like him. I like him. Uh, I like him a lot. Very cute. So then it's Honey's last day today. So I'm gonna get her to have a baby with Chestnut. I think. I think I do like chestnuts. So I'm gonna have them to have a baby like that. I'm gonna move this baby out of the nest and hopefully get Honey in there. There you go. I think he's Honey's kid as well, isn't he? <laughs> yeah. So that's basically Honey's nest. Um, I'll get you to come out of that nest. There, I'm gonna get you to grab some stuff. Um, why doesn't Sunny come and join his dad? Why not? <laughs> That's cute. They actually kind of look like... I don't know. I think it might just be the, um... The mane that makes them look so similar. But, oh, I like that. That's really cute. <laughs> they were sitting next to each other. Um, then we've got Baby over here, which is... Oh, no, I've already seen that one. Uh, Baby over here, which is Shade and Lana's uh, son, which is very cute. I'm absolutely in love with him. Uh, very, very cute. I'm liking that one. And I think that's it. For the babies, at least. Obviously, we've still got creatures to move. But I think that's all the babies that were born last time, which is great. Uh, Louise and Sparrow, they are st I'm still going to leave them for a few, I don't know, days to have babies. Because they don't really need to just yet. Uh, I'm going to get you to grab that bunny for me. Thank you very much. Um... Andreas is for some reason babysitting these kids over here. I think I'm going to leave him. I think those babies are okay together. Oh, why did I put them in a nest? Why, what was that for? Why did I do that? <laughs> uh, Tamale, I guess I'm just going to get you to make your own nest like that. There you go. Oh, and she actually managed to pick it. Uh, Andreas hasn't got any kids yet, obviously. So... It's gonna be a nightmare. I'm gonna figure out who's had babies with who so far. So, Cookie's had a baby with Koi, Colt, and that's it. So she can still have a baby with Chester. So I'll get her to come over there. And then they can uh, breed. There you go. And you can grab that, please. Because we can get more nesting material from that. There you go. And then these guys are just sort of... I don't know. Doing this. <laughs> there you go. Trying to make them a bit useful while they're so young. Right, this baby, I've got to keep him next to his brother because otherwise the baby's going to get eaten. But the bird... Okay, Tortilla's last day is today. Where is the bird? I haven't seen it in a while. He's still over here, that's fine. <laughs> okay. Um, why don't we, like, can we try and get these guys to chase it? Like, where's the... Why can't I attack it? Is it too high or something? Because surely I'm above it. <gasps> okay. Okay, I got, I got it. I mean, underneath it, not not above it. Okay. Uh, Colt's last day is tomorrow? No, it's today. So I think he's had all of his kids, or at least... Yeah, he's got three kids, which is the amount he was meant to have. So I'm going to bring him over here with Nero. Because I think they have the same... Oh no, he's about to pass away the next day. Okay. Well, they can just stay there. Uh, Syrup's done with having babies, so... Oh, it's her last day as well today! Well, I guess I'll move her over here too. Koi's got a while left to live, so I'm going to bring him over, sort of babysit all the babies, just in case. Because I don't want anything to happen to them if, you know, all the parents have left. And that's everyone again! So, we'll go to the next day. How many babies are we born today? I think, like, two were born today? Is that bird? Oh, we've got two birds now! Are you kidding me? 
Oh. All right. Well. Um. Fly and attack prey. Wait, is there a is there a bunny there? There's nothing there. Did that bird count as our prey? <laughs> It didn't say attack bird of prey, it just said attack prey, which I didn't realise was even a thing. But I guess it was low enough for us to attack, which is great. Oh, look at all that food we're getting, yes. Loki, I'm bringing you back because you need to have a baby with um, Lana again. And there's a, there's a birdie down here, which I want to keep an eye out for. Uh, Finley, grab that bunny for us. Um, see, Avery now is gonna, yes, attack that bird, which is gonna be amazing. I can't wait. Um, I guess I'll start bringing Louise and Sparrow back, or they could start helping attack this bird, and they'll 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 get back to the their family like super quickly anyway. So it's not like we've. Oh yes, oh yes, we got the birdies. We got both of them. They're gone. Yes. <laughs> and then Lana, I'm gonna get her to make her way over to Loki and have them breed, and obviously they won't have a baby just yet, but I'm gonna bring Shade down to his. Well, kid and other child. <laughs> so that there's at least one adult with these guys. Okay, so Lana's pregnant. She can come back down. She doesn't have to have a baby now. Um, I saw a bunny up here, which... Dang it. Um, and then all these guys, again, I'm just going to get them to t try on for this bit. Are you, are you kidding me? None of them have got it? I guess I'll bring them on there. Okay. <laughs> um, all right. Wait, so Nero only had one daughter, I just realised, because he had a son with Syrup as well. So he only had he only had one daughter. Oh, and he, she's literally got the exact same pattern as him, which is actually adorable. Um Oh, and then Syrup and uh, Syrup and Colt died just then. So there's bones there. And then Nero's gonna pass away again today. Again. Nero's gonna pass away today. <laughs> um Alright, there's all these nests and stuff. I think that's Koi's kid. Oh look at the black black antlers that's cool so koi's got three kids now which i think is what we was meant to have so cookie um cookie tamale and honey they've all had his kids which is lovely and then i think where's chestnut chestnut's only got one kid well one of them's definitely pregnant with his kid cookie is pregnant with his kid okay yes that's what that's what it is okay um so bring oh there's so many bunnies over there koi's all of it koi's had all of his kids so why don't i get into like bunny hunt i guess starlight can come down and grab that one and there's one other there's one other one over here but i can't get to it in time okay oh no wait yes okay oh lots of bunny hunting that makes me really excited <laughs> tamale can jump out of the nest and get pregnant with andreas's kid does he have no, he doesn't have Stinky Tail, so I'm going to give him Stinky Tail in his recessive genes. Because for some reason it doesn't have it yet. Um, and that's it for them. So I'll breed them two together. And then... Uh, who else needs to have Andreas's kids? Oh! Syrup. Whoops, I thought Syrup was only having a baby with... Wait, Syrup? No, she was... She was pink, so wait. Honey? Did Honey die? I think Honey died, so yes. But I'm sure there was another one. Tamale. Cookie. But she's already pregnant with um, Chestnut's kid. Okay, that's that's fine. Just as long as I remember which one. Okay, I'm going to bring you out, which is very cute. But let me, ju let me just jump in. And then uh, Syrup's kid can jump out. I'm going to put this kid in here so he babysits them. <laughs> um, let's fix up a nest. Let's put Tamale in there. There you go. And then she should be having a baby next time. Let's just grab some food and stuff. Lark is still around here. I guess I'll get him to go over here so he can look. Some more bunnies. Chestnut can just stay here and, I don't know, do that. <laughs> and that's everyone again. Okay. Um, I think I'll end this one here, though. Before we end the final... Or before we have the last babies of the generation, I think I'll end this one here because there's already, like... How many babies have we had? We've got 30 creatures in total. I mean, look at all these kids we've got. My goodness. One, two... Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. 10, 11. Uh, so we've got, what, 19 kids? Jeez, and I've only named like four of them. Oh my gosh. I couldn't name like 15 children. That's going to be insane. Um, that's going to be hard. Okay. Um, I'm sort of hoping that it snows while the, the, while the generation is quite young so that we get a few more days of 
um, cold in our in our genes for that. <gasps> Wait, the time in cold climate is eleven days now. <gasps> it might be time. To, it might be. It might be getting a bit colder. Okay, that's good. Um, but I still think we're going to be leaving before we manage to get the thirty days in, which is going to suck. But hopefully, we'll find an icy island again soon. But yes, I will end this one here though. So thank you guys so much for watching. I really do appreciate it, and I will see you guys next time. Bye.